After watching today's video, you will be able to define the two basic categories of cracks. List the seven facts about plastic shrinkage in fresh concrete and list seven recommendations to minimize plastic shrinkage cracks. It's important that we have a thorough understanding of what causes cracks before we can recommend a cure. Why does concrete crack? It's important to know that cracks are classified into two categories. First are structural cracks. Structural cracks are the result of a load applied to the concrete that exceeds its strength limitations. Second are self-imposed cracks. These cracks result from a volume change because of a change in the temperature or moisture content. Plastic shrinkage cracks are the most common form of cracks found in concrete. Cracks found in fresh concrete are usually called green or plastic shrinkage cracks because they appear while the concrete is still in the plastic state. Here are some facts about plastic shrinkage cracks. Fact number one, the volume of hardened concrete changes with variations in moisture, temperature, and stress. Fact number two, plastic shrinkage is a natural, unchangeable property of concrete. Fact number three, while concrete remains moist, it will expand slightly. Fact number four, when concrete is permitted to dry, it will shrink. Fact number five, the primary factor that determines the amount of shrinkage is the water content. Fact number six, other factors such as aggregate size, shape and volume, humidity, ambient temperature, and the method of curing also influences the degree of which concrete shrinks. Fact number seven, Excessive bleed water on the surface of the concrete will increase surface shrinkage. This is why the use of high slump concrete is always discouraged. 